the DC CW Arrowverse has been one of the most popular franchises for the fans out there. And you know, ET has caught up with the cast from all of those favorite shows over the years. And here's a little montage of some of the craziness that's happened. All right, come on guys, come on Arrowcast, come on. Sorry. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna do an interview. Okay. This is live, but we're still gonna have a This is live. This is live. <laughs> this is live. This is live, so don't do all the things I do. I'm doing them now because you're asking me not to. This is wonderful, Tom. Thank you. Oh, God. Here we go. Three, two, one. Hey, baby. Hey, everyone. Welcome to ET Live with the cast of Supergirl. We're very excited. We're going to yeah. preface all of this and saying things are about to get a little weird. How has your Comic-Con experience been so far? Highlight, best part. This right now, li yeah. living in the moment. Yes. Didn't yes. want to abbreviate it, really wanted to. Yeah. <laughs> For me, the best part so far mm -hmm. was mm -hmm. almost crashing the Justice League photo shoot. Mm -hmm. Did you? Yeah, that was fun. But then Jason Momoa was so big, I was like. This doesn't look like we're going to be allowed to do this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah. We definitely I don't we're gonna know have... this man. Arrow is getting the reputation. People are going to be scared of us. Yeah. Like, I think you should, be. They should be. you should you be. You see the Arrow crew coming, yeah, you turn you, around and yeah. go the other you way. You run and you call we're security the, for yourself. Well, well, we're the OG. Yeah. That's so right. OG, OG. Everyone else can f off. Anytime my friends are like, oh my god, you play superhero on TV? Like, what's your power? And I'm like, well. Being an awesome leader. Yeah, like, that sounds super lame. <laughs> Yeah, stop. She's not your real girlfriend. <laughs> no, oh my god. That's I would crazy. like to see them get back together and be so happy. <laughs> <laughs> it's good marital tension where it's like you're not afraid of them getting divorced, but you know, they got they got stuff to work out, like any yeah. marriage. And if it doesn't work out, then I feel like nope. Katie and Jess, we saw some pretty adorable moments between these two lovely ladies last year. What can you tease that's moving ahead for them? Because I ship it. Hey, oh. That ship is sailed. Oh, what hey. <laughs> no, that means a good thing. Oh. No, oh. no. <laughs> I mean, right? It's no, it doesn't. No. No. It's, it's, not good. Good. Yeah. 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 it's landed at the port. Stop. The sail is going away. Yes. You, you didn't get on it. It oh. sailed away. No, we're on the ship. Okay. <laughs> we have left the port, but we're on the ship. Yeah. Together. Yes. We're together. all Their together. We're full yeah. steam ahead. And yes. it's really nice. Right? Like, take my hand. Take my hand. Get on the ship. Are you guys playing with inappropriate props? No, 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 no. First off, I consider myself the biggest <laughs> West Allen fan. But the truth is this, love is bigger than so many things. How's your con going so far? How exhausted so are you? Pretty, 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 pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> no one else is looking pretty, pretty good. Is Supergirl's new suit? I mean, yes. Yes. Oh my goodness gracious, <laughs> pants. 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 I want a yeah. cape. I want a cape. <laughs> <laughs> and it feels right. It feels like the good, like a, the right evolution mm. and the right time to do it. And I can All kick. All the girls are like, and it's I can awesome. stretch. It's high yes, kick season. <laughs> and, I, and I'm not, not taking your cape it. anymore and trying to cover it. That was season one. I yeah. was always trying to cover her with yeah. the cape. Lots of crotch shots that yeah. we don't want. <laughs> but live, Melissa. Sorry. No. How's your interview going? And it's going great, in. Tom. Shush. What am I supposed to say? You're all dead, and I can't talk about it. They're all dead, confirmed. These days, we're all trying to take the piss out of each other. Oh, yeah, uh, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Marvelous. 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 That's it. With all the Vikings and they just had yeah. this puppet. And, it's like... and all of a sudden, that's when basically Legends became this critical little darling because, you know, we, 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 we poke fun at ourselves and that's the, I think that's the genius of the show. I can't believe you let that's us do bit. this. That's a bit. We hope yeah. certifiably legal. I'm sorry this... for swearing twice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thanks so much for watching. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Felt the same as always. Love it. <laughs> and you know what this universe does so well? Crossovers. I loved seeing Ezra Miller show up in The Flash. It was so good seeing him and Grant Gustin interact. And I know a lot of the Flash fans are really bummed that we're not getting the cast at Comic-Con this year. But to make up for it, I caught up with Grant Gustin and Candace Patton recently and asked them how they would feel about a little West Allen redo wedding. Does anyone have just cause why these two should not be married? 
Speak now or forever hold your peace. Looking ahead to next season, and fingers crossed if we do get Iris out of that mirror world. Yeah. I've, you and I have chatted about this many times before. What are the chances on that West Allen vowel renewal? Since we all agreed their wedding was a yeah. little bit yeah. of a different thing. Yes. <laughs> then I pronounce you both. Uh, wait, 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 just one second. Um, I don't know. That's actually not something we've discussed, but um, I, I could see it making sense and us needing it, especially now after finishing this whole Mirrorverse storyline and us being so separated. And um, yeah, that would be probably a cool thing to see actually once the, the this is all the storyline's all resolved. All right, Grant, I'm going to be chatting with Candace next. Do you have a question for her? Yeah, well, considering our wedding was spoiled on a crossover of Supergirl. True. And then we had a, I, let's say, a shotgun wedding on an episode of Legends of Tomorrow. <laughs> so terrible. Would she be interested in renewing our vows on Flash? Not our vows, Barry and Iris' vows, obviously. Because I think that'd be fun. It sounds like fans need it. That's a great point, which is something I will say, something I would love to see before we end the show, whenever that is. I think a lot of fans were disappointed with the how Barry and Iris ended up getting married. And I think that's a fair, fair thing to be kind of um, peeved about. And so yes, Grant, I agree. I think we should revisit that at some point. I think we should give the fans what they want. I think we all were a little bit like, how did we get married on another show? When you buy the DVDs of The Flash in the future, you're never gonna see Barry and Iris getting married for real. So I think it's only right that before we wrap up the show, Barry and Iris get married on their own show. So for posterity, Flash fans have that in their DVD collection. Yes, let's do it.